Welcome back, my friends. I think I'm getting close. I'm pretty sure that Area 6 here will be Big Man, and then that'll be all three. So then we'll go to the rocket ship, and after that, well, the story will be over. So this is probably, I'm going to guess this is the second to last recording. So thank you guys for coming along for the trip and the ride. Especially anybody that has been there for the last month since I have started recording the Octo Expansion and then went right into this. These Super Reddits, they're quite long. And I know that there are the people that have been returning for each one of them. So if you guys have been enjoying this, absolutely let me know. 100%. All right, let's go. All right, so this is the point. I can either go down that direction and I see one there. Or I can take this rail here. So I'm going to see what's on this rail. I believe I have not been up here. And I am correct. So I have three at least that I'm going to get into. So this one is don't tease with the keys and look my best main of mains is there the blah blobber the skill gradient between any other weapon that i have and blah blobber is absolutely hilarious because in anarchy if i play any weapon that is not the blah blobber i am definitely a b plus player and then with this thing my record on a clam blitz round of all things was 38 kills and i've been playing with s rank players and x rank players and i've even friended a couple of them after the match so i'm positive that they were x rank and yet with any other weapon i am absolutely trash like it is it is a huge skill gradient i am uh i am min maxing hard but speaking of that where is this guy going oh you have bombs aha I was going to say, this thing's, uh, this thing's going in a, it's in a random path, but it's a defined random path, so it got stuck and messed itself up, so, alright, so I guess the goal of the game here, I should have been reading when I was talking about Blah Blobber, is just make sure that we can see where everyone's at and take them out, which you guys are not going to survive because I'm playing up the angles, and the angles are my friend. Ink recovery is not. Hmm. There we go. I was going to say, you're going to die. But uh, he did die, just not on time. All right. Let's see. Where do we go next? So I saw two of them go this, this way as well. I saw them when they scattered. That is inkable. So high ground. Come on. There we go. I was going to say, I know I can get up. It's got a little lip at the end, but that's, that's nothing. All right. I don't need a bird's eye view. Death from above. I was going to say, there you go. All right. Um, I saw the other one. And he's got power eggs, so I will take him out in the spirit of competition. I thought I was going to land all of those on him and get him, but I guess not. All right. So where did he run off to is the question. Dude... The Splatfests have been absolutely amazing with you guys, and I really appreciate the great Splatfests. The one that I'm really looking forward to is at the time of this recording, Big Big Run is coming. And Big Big Run, I, I'm going to try to set the whole day aside to stream that. I can't wait, dude. I may not be like an overfishing competitive, or is there even, yeah, there's got to be a competitive community for Salmon Run as well. Um, I'm not a competitive person for Salmon Run if there is one, but that said, I am a Salmon Run junkie, and Big Big Run is the thing I've been waiting for. At the time of this recording, too, the Grizzco Roller has been... An Where did that guy go? The Grizzco Roller has been announced, so that is 100% on the table at this point. It's weird that they, they announced it. It was a weird way they announced it. They didn't announce it formally, but they did put it on, like... I think it was on the European Nintendo NSO. They put it on there that, you know, now featuring the new Grizzco Roller. And it was like, they put it right on the website. And I'm like, that was a weird way to confirm it. But all right. A lot of people, I think, thought it was a splatling. Well, I did too. That's the thing. So the only reason that people knew it, and I love it because I know some people that are in a Discord. And I guess I'm calling them out, but they'll never see this recording, to be honest. Um, they are like know-it-alls. So when they're like... I don't know, you, the, the recording, or the recording, 
the uh, the announcement that they made of a Grizz weapon coming for Big Big Run was it looked like a splatling. It really did. It had a picture of a splatling on there, and yet uh, it was like I don't know. It was like the person that was saying it's a roller. It's not a splatling. It expected people to know that it was uh, it was a spl roller rather, not a splatling. Because everybody has access to the data mined info. It was like, dude, okay, I didn't even look at data mined info. I'm looking at the thing here, and it looks like a splatling. It's, it's, it, it, I mean, look, Grizzco splatling is trending. I'm like, what do you want me to think here? Oh, I am telling a story instead of killing this guy, so. I'm going to say, you're, uh, you're going to be done here soon. You're quick, but you're not that quick. You're not fast enough to outrun fate. Oh, he does recover, though. Okay, I guess that's what I'm not seeing. All right, my bad. It was the fact that he's recovering that I, I need to pay more attention to. There we go. I was going to say, he's got power eggs because the first one had a key. So, now I've got three keys. I got to get those power eggs, so I will uh, I will at least do that much. Well, okay, I guess there was nothing in there. I already got the power eggs. My bad. Up we go. All right, ride the ink rails, which, by the way, you guys know I hate ink rails. I literally, God, I hate ink rails. Splatling is no longer even my arch enemy. I, I'm good with Splatling at this point. I'm happy with Splatling. Splatling is my friend. Interesting. I missed one. All right, let's. Uh, I guess I do need a bird's eye view. Let's see. I killed three. I need one more. So where would that last one be? Took him out over here. Hmm. Don't want to go that way. I have a cat behind me that's messing with the curtains. But we're not going to concern ourselves with that. We're going to let the cat do cat things. I'm going to look around, and I'm going to find. I'm going to seek and destroy. And that is my goal and mission in life here. Alright, maybe I do need the bird's eye view. These little guys are quick. So now I need to know, where did he go? He's right there. Look at him. He's dancing, and he's messing around, and you know what? He's going to die. It's weird, like, where where was he? Was he just free-floating around the whole area? I need to reset my controller there. Alright, here we go. The fact that he sprinted after the first hit. Very, very tricky little guy. Alright, so he's around the corner? Interesting. Where did he go? I know he's around here, so he can't hide, but... He's definitely in a different spot than I expected because I thought he was just going to run in a defined path, but there he is. All right, I was just going to say I'll get the uh, I'll get the jump on him. I'll ninja squid him. All right. Back to where I was. The first level of the recording was an excellent success. I got to use my main and then my main of mains. And now Victory is mine, my friends. Thank you for enjoying the ride. Blah blabber, I shall miss you. Mission complete. What you got, little buddy? He's got something. Oh, I could already see that one. I will definitely 100%. But not... Yeah, probably not. Yeah, you know what? I'm not going to do it on recording. I was going to say, I could technically do it on stream. But now, nah, stream, everybody's going to want to play. Not watch me do a single player campaign. Oh, yeah, that's right. My bad. The next one. Uh, You know what? Eat that first and then we'll do this. Let me change it up a little bit, you know? Sardinium, which, hey, I have been finally upgrading, so at least I, I can say that much. Dive and dash. Oh, yeah, look at this. I love it. Ooh, arrow spray. Arrow spray is my Splatfest main. 
the dark city vibes. I dig the color. Reach the goal within the time limit. Ready? Uh, pressure's on, Agent 3. All right, so we're going to have to do this quick with an arrow spray. I got you. Let's go. All right. So. So far, so good. We had a we had a level like this already, but I think it was with a brush. Nice! I saw that before it uh, before it was doomsday. All right, got the checkpoint. We're good. Blind speed run. Here we go. Oh my god! Well, I mean, I guess I get the checkpoint anyways, but that was a very stupid little move I just did. That little, uh, that little squid roll, squid roll. Oh, no, 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 no. That was, uh, it was a skinny rail that, or I shouldn't say rail, it was a skinny part of the, uh, the path that I was not prepared for. Probably should have grabbed that, but hey. Uh-oh. I'm gonna be just fine. There we go. I was gonna say, do I have to deal with octos or anything? Is this inkable? Nope, not inkable. This is though. All right, running out of time. Here we go. Oh right, what am I doing? Yeah, do that. All paths explored. Here we go. I think I just missed some eggs, but I will. I will not relish on that. Here we go. Checkpoint, and it's the final checkpoint. All right, here we go. I don't have time for missiles and, and octo zeppelins and whatever else they may have for me. Oh, jeez. I don't have time for you either. I'm not even going to explode you. I just don't care about you. And mission complete. Well, that was a fun one. It also further emphasizes the fact that I bet we could do a Splatoon racing game. Imagine a Splatoon racing game where you could also dismount your vehicle and swim around. I'm telling you guys, I need to just go on Nintendo's website and there is a section that's like, suggest stuff to them. I probably have all these. Oh, I can't even see what they are. I'm already, I've been level 50 on, uh, on table turf for since season one. So at this point, those cards are meaningless. Although they did increase the maximum level, I have no interest in continuing my quest and escapade to be the best. Table turf is not what gets me going. Hmm. This looks important. And only for 900. Alright, here we go. Check it out. Let's go. It's called... Enter the Stamp Gauntlet. Oh, Team Hammer time. Let's go. And that's all I have is a stamper. Oh, man. Is this what I think it is? Unlimited stamper power? Yes, let's go. I am going to destroy everything. I am going to take down Inkopolis. And rebuild it. In fact, I'm not even going to rebuild it because I don't want to rebuild it. I'm just going to take it down. Here we go. I am the greatest. Ugh. Yes, this is what I've been waiting for. Oh, let's do it. Final checkpoint. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, die. 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 You guys got nothing on Team Hammer Time. Let's go. This is here solely for satisfaction because I deserve this. After everything I've been put through, I deserve to have nothing but OP. Don't forget to throw it. I don't need to throw it. I could just jump. <laughs> I am very satisfied with this. Crush, crush, crush. Just give me a whole game, a whole side game where these things spawn forever. That's all I want. All right, maybe I do need to throw that. Down you go. Ow. I think I took damage there when he spawned. And that's okay. Uh-oh. Uh I did not realize that I had a time limit. Oh, crap. 
So I had a time limit, huh? Well, that makes sense. I was wondering what it was going to be. All right, here we go. All right, so in this this run, what I will do is I will make sure that I don't have to I don't have to stop. We can just go. Not only that, but I didn't realize that uh Nice. So, yeah, I was going to say I can just jump and get those. All right, let's uh let's follow the the path here. All right, wasting a lot of time on that one. All right, no worries though. All right, let's see. This is the big one. All right, here we go. Got 17 seconds to do this. I feel strong. I feel invincible. I feel that I can do anything because I have the hammer of hell. Mission complete. Ah, that stamper felt satisfying. Putting the hurt in the dirt. Let's go. And look, little buddy's got something too. Nice. Check it out, a little umbrella. I may actually redecorate my locker someday, finally. All right. Give me that, and then this is probably Big Man's area, and I'm not ready for Big Man quite yet. We're going to jump down here first. No fall damage, which is beautiful. Breathe in. <gasps> Breathe out. <sighs> All right. Uh, give me the stringer going with the main. The one who pays the piper picks the tune. Let's go. All right, move carefully to reach the goal. All right, and I've got armor. That is not inkable. That is. All right, so. Okay, I see it. Oops. All right, so, yeah, this one, okay, I've misunderstood where that one was actually going, and I thought for a sec that something was hidden in the, oh, crap, I took too long when I was charging that, hmm, that didn't hit him? There we go. I was gonna say I can't believe that was uh that wasn't hitting him. Alright. Next. Look, power eggs. Alright. Making our way up. Here we go. Agent three, we got this. Hmm. One there and one there. And you're shielded? Yeah, you're shielded. Which is fine because I could just break your shield and I will spam arrows until I do, so. Is this the most scientific way to take you down? No, but I, it is my way and I'm going to make it satisfying because your shield's going to break and I'm going to be like, take that. Alright, there we go. Problem solved. Man, these things take way more than I thought they would. I keep trying to just shoot the bombs next to them so they'll explode. And then I realize that they, they take way more of a beating than that. Alright, can I get you is the question. Oh, hi. Alright, yeah, I was going to say that's a futile effort. Takes him out. Takes him out. Ah, right, here we go. And that should be everybody. Hey, look at that. In fact, I don't know why I even went this way. 
All right. It has been a pleasure on this round. This level was nice and satisfying. But, alas, all good things come to an end, so here we go. Mission complete. Anytime that you see or hear, I should say, me taking like a, a quick breather or a quick break, anytime that there's there's no noise at all, that is usually me drinking coffee. So I'm going to eat that just because I know I have to, but uh, and I have a lot of power eggs at the moment, but technically I don't need that. Hey, a tapestry. Let's see what we got. Ooh, gnarly. Seems these are instructions on how to mummify an inkling. What? Maybe in olden times, inklings thought if they preserved their bodies after death, they could be revived someday. But that's... Well, there's no way this is a real one stuck here, right? Of course it's not. Right? Whoa. Yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty gnarly, man. Wow. Especially for it to be on the on the tapestry like that. Hey, there's actually one right here. Check it out. Keep it rolling. Keep rolling, man. All right, what are my options? Splat roller, carbon. Give me the splat roller. Move in and move out. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. And roll you over because I am done with everybody. I'm just going to keep rolling, just like it says, which is definitely a Limp Bizkit reference. Death to you. Uh, oh, for a sec, I thought I couldn't do that. All right, let me grab that really quickly. All right, back to keep rolling. Uh, ooh, ooh. You may be able to sneak by this one. Why would I want to sneak when I can roll? Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Can't really roll this guy over. I can't get up to him, but still. Alright, that takes care of him. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Here we go. Death to you. Nice. Checkpoint achieved. Here we go. Not stopping. Rolling everybody over. I miss the I miss these bounce pads in shifty stations like just having them in an actual match i know it, it's shifty station it's uh it's not anarchy so th there's nothing to worry about in terms of like the competitive crowd getting upset for these i have runneth out of ink the cup runs dry there we go all right let's go having these in a splat vest round i i missed that that was a really fun well, you guys know, God, I beat this to death already, is I miss Shifty Station. They would try wild stuff, whether it worked or not, at least they were trying it. It was fun. The tricolor matches, I feel like it, they would have been better suited if they took a break, went to a Shifty Station for a little while, and then came back and did tricolors. You know, if they were to, if they were to circulate the two out, then maybe... Alright, he sees me, so... You know what? I wonder, can I just... Can I just... Yeah, I was gonna say, can I just roll you over? And you! Ugh, take that! You know what? I don't even need to kill the others. I'm just going for it. Here's the, the checkpoint, or I'm sorry, here's the mission complete. And take that. Nice. Making good timing over here, man. All right. So the question now becomes, is Big Man up next? Hmm. So I know I can do that, and I know I can do that. So the question is, what is on the sides of these? Are there more? Nope, nope. That's just to go backwards. I would, I'm not going to say it's wasted at this point, just because... I'm going to 100% it anyways. They had to go anyway. Alright, so. 
I think that's it. I will meet you right up at the top. Alright, so I've noticed a flaw in my plan here. Or actually, I take it back. I bet this is it right here. So there are two that I can do before Big Man. That one down there? Yep. Okay, I was going to say, this rail goes right there, doesn't it? Nice. Alright, so we'll start with this one. This one is Octarian Heights. As long as there's no rails, I'm okay. Ah, eh, give me the hero gear. No fee for this. I'm surprised that any of them have no fee. We're pretty far into the game here. Alright. Climb and reach the, uh, that. No problem. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I didn't realize. I was like, <laughs> I'm just relaxing over here. I'm having a good time. I'm just casually chilling. And then what happens? Uh, oh, we're going down? Well, sure. And uh, all of a sudden, they have splatlings. I'm like, uh, was not prepared for such heavy uh, firepower. All right, let's do it. Oh, yeah, you. All right, uh, I have little buddy. You know what? Yeah, why don't you uh, eat that thing's face off? All right. Oh, splashdowns. Heck yeah, I forgot. I have uh, I have splashdowns. I have little buddy like I'm invincible. All right, so now the question becomes, do I take everything out or do I just sort of enjoy my life and and go around in a circle until uh, until I find a path up? All right, you're you're shooting at me, but I can't get you. So the, that splashdown that I have in the pack here, that is reserved for you. It's sitting in the pack, ready to go. And someday you will fail to to fight, and you will feel the pain of that splashdown right in your face. I'm gonna lay the ink head down on you. All right, let's see. Now I have to look around. All right, so first off, eat your face off. There you go. Next. Hmm. There must be a path that's right up the center here because... Uh, well, let's take a look. Can I go backwards? Alright, can't go backwards. Just double checking that. Alright, so he's sniping, so I definitely want to climb up here if I can. So we gotta find something inkable that I can go up. Up, oh, here it is. See? Just gotta keep my eyes open. My bad. Alright, so. Up we go. You guys aren't so tough. Even that sniper, once I get it, once I get close to you, you're you're done. What, some aim aim exercises? Oh, that's for you. That's for trying to snipe me this entire time. That's for breaking my good vibes and making me have to be paranoid that you're going to snipe me. All right, made it up. Triple ink strike. Good thing I used that splash down then if I hadn't. Uh... All right, there's one, there's two, there's three. I'm pretty sure that'll take care of you guys. Was it, was it really that easy? I do believe it was that easy. Mission complete. Nice. Hey, what you got? Don't tell Agent 2, but I really... I don't really like high places. I, uh... I don't like rails, so that's something you should keep to yourself, too. Let's grab this before I go. Hey, Sardinium. It was worth it. Alright, this is Mission Fly Fishing. Uh... I had some trouble with the inkjet in Ogto. All right, well, you know what? It's been a while. Let's do this. Haven't had to do a fly-only mission in a while, so maybe uh, it's a new day. Ooh, nice. All right, I retreat, or er, I attack in the defensive position. I, uh, I retreat only to get a better... There we go. I was going to say, I can just uh, run across that. I, uh, I was backing up and attacking at the same time. 
Thus, my defense, my best defense is an offense. All right, here we go. Okay, all good. Now, in Octo, I had problems with this because, well, for every reason known to man, actually. All right, here we go. Easy does it. Just be careful. Have a little finesse. Fly with a little confidence and precision. Here we go. Down we go. One of the things that stumped me back in Octo that I kept messing up with this inkjet was that I can go down like this and then do that. And I kept messing that up for some reason, which is what I'm going to do right now, actually. Look, I got a little armor. All right, we're going to fly real high. It's going to feel good. We're going to have a fun time here. There's going to be no stress. I don't need stress. That one, remember in Octo, the uh, survive the bowling balls for 30 seconds? And that one, that one kind of skunked me. Yeah, I would say that one was pretty bad. It, it could have been a lot worse, but it was, it was a rough one. All right, there you go. Give me those power eggs and let's go. Not bad, not bad. It's not as difficult as Octo, but regardless, I think I can lay stick to the claim that I have improved with this thing. All right, here we go. And... Oh, hi. Can I hit you? Oh, crap. Oh. All right, so we're going to have to do that. Oh, they all die. Perfect. No problem. Here I was thinking that I'd actually have to do something challenging there. I just had to sink a single shot. Mission complete. Nice. Alright, so I think I'm going to take the guess here and say I got everything. Let's see how the map looks. There may be one here. Uh, let me take a look. You know what? Let's. I think the best thing to do is meet you at the top. And I'll take a look bird's eye again. Oh, I'm actually going to get that bird's eye look. I'm going straight back up here. Sweet. All right. So here's what I'm thinking is I will get to the top here and scour the land from above. Just in case I missed anything. I think I did miss one. Look right there. Right there. I missed one. Yeah, I definitely missed that. One would wonder how I flew right over that. Oh, it's because I hate rails. I forgot about that. All right, this is called The Enemy Ink is Lava. The Enemy Ink is Lava! Since Inklings are canon in... Oh, that's all I get is the curling, curling bomb. Uh, Inklings are canon in Smash Bros. I mean, we have seen what an Inkling in Lava looks like, so that would be kind of cool for them to throw a lava stage. Uh, oh, you only get one curling bomb per area. Interesting. Okay. I dig it. All right. So this one. Oh, I thought I jumped further than that. Okay. This is, uh, this is an interesting little escapade here. Touch enemy ink and you die. Gotcha. All right. So there we go. I was going to say, Ooh, I almost botched it. All right, here we go. Don't touch the enemy ink. That's the name of the game. All right, so that angle, I see. You know what? I think we can do it. There we go. Nice. Just don't touch the enemy ink, and we'll be all right. I remember that Octo expansion stage. That one was uh, that was brutal because your foot would just barely contact the uh, the enemy ink, and that was all it took. All right, grab those power eggs. Let's go. And technically, I do have a time limit, but that time limit appears to be excessive. So, all right, so I want to go straight through. Uh, uh oh, this could be a problem. Well, nah, it'll be all right. There we go. All good. And look, the timer's increasing. All right, as long as I don't have enemies to deal with. All right, let's analyze. 
So I can bounce it off of there. Oh, this is for the power eggs. Yeah, you know what? I can do it. There we go. No problem. Oh, I touched enemy ink. Oh, Orca, I hate you. Not a fan of... Oh, I had to, I had to go back far on that one. Uh, uh-oh. Well, that's a problem, isn't it? Oh, that was so close. <laughs> that was uh that was a botch by me. All right, so basically, let's uh let's just say forget it on that. All right, here we go. So, give me that. And yeah, give me the bird's eye view. I need to see where I'm going. Okay, I saw where I'm going. I'm good. All right, so we're going to want to hit that. Yeah, we're just going to bounce it straight, but I have to be careful about the, the washer. No problem. Let's go. I'm dead. <laughs> I was going to say, wait a minute. I thought I made it further than that. Oh, I okay. Retry from checkpoint. I have uh, botched it royally. My bad. That was, uh, that really was bad. Alright, my bad. Let's do this again. Oh, crap. Well, I've already shown that I can, I can get to this one without touching enemy ink, so. Alright, I can do that without touching enemy ink, but I don't even need the bombs, but that was a botch. Nonetheless, it's just a botch I can get away with. You know what, we got time. We, oh, whoops, didn't mean to do that. I meant to just come over here. As for what I was told about you only get one per area, that was a lie. Alright, here we go. Oh, no! <laughs> I thought I cleared it. Oh, I thought I cleared it. Okay, my bad. Alright, let's go. That was, uh, that was dumb. Alright, let's try this one more time. All right, off we go. Grab the ink. One more try with that. Here we go. Actually, yeah, I can just go. Oh, I keep running into it, dude. I kept. Ah, oh, I keep trying to jump over that thing. I, I am a fool. I am such a fool. All right, one more try. I am not going to fail this time. There we go. All right, give me that. And watch that washer. Here we go. All right, check this one out. Yeah, now we're talking. All right, so. Hmm. Which way do we go? can dodge that entirely, or I can get the power eggs. Yeah, I think we go for the power eggs. Oh, I touched enemy ink. <laughs> Dude, no. Oh. All right, no problem. Just got to be very mindful and careful. Here we go. All right, perfect. Grab another one. Here we go. All right. So straight through, it would appear. Yeah, straight through. Whoa. Okay. Dodge that. And here we go. All right. So I want that wall right there. All right. Here we go. All right, here we go. Nice. Up we go. Oh, that's it, actually. All right. Well, I would have uh, I would have been cool if we had gone a few more. But yeah. Mission complete. Nice. All right. Well, I am glad I came back for this one. That was fun. You got something, little buddy? I see nothing. All right. I'll meet you back at Big Man. 
All right, one more time with that bird's eye view. So I'm pretty sure I got that one this time. So I'm pretty sure I've got everything. I know that one down there, I definitely already got. Yeah, I, I did. I got that one. I can see. Just in case I thought maybe I hadn't. I'm good. Got that one. All right, I think that's 100%. Got everything. So, all right, big man. Let's do this. I'm ready. All right, let's do this. The Obscurest Chiaroscurist. All right. Big man, time to fight. wonder what Big Man could have. I mean, the shark and the eels made sense, so I have no idea what Big Man would have. All right, Big Man, let's do this. <laughs> he, looks, he looks ridiculous. I didn't read the dialogue because I was impressed with the mask. This treasure isn't yours. You can't have it. I wouldn't fight you if I didn't have to, but this is for Splatsville. All right. Interesting. Ooh, I like that. Oh, the Hype Manta Storm Big Man. I like that. All right, check out my sweet moves. You remind me of... Uh, this is like in Mario Sunshine. Yeah, this is Mario Sunshine, dude. This is exactly where they got that. Ooh, wow. Phase one, I'm already done. Can you guess which one is the real me? You're pretty good. But I won't lose. Dude, they literally got this from Mario Sunshine. I've been training too hard to lose. All right, so definitely just attack, 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 attack. Here we go. This is literally from Mario Sunshine, and I love it. Just got to watch out for those bombs. All right, where's the last one? All right, here we go. Oh, hi. You know what? Found him. Nice. Dude, I am digging the Mario Sunshine level. You've got moves. That's true. But I've got uh, more moves. No more kid gloves. It's big man time. All right, big man. I think, uh, I think you're at a massive disadvantage with me already knowing what this level entails. I played Mario Sunshine. I'm aware. Oh, okay. You're, you're switching it up a little bit. I just got to be mindful of... Ooh, that's that's an unfortunate happening right there. Okay, hang on. Ooh. All right, so... Oh, I was going to say. All right, let's, uh, let's back it up. All right, let's look around. All right, here we go. Back up, back up. The one I got to watch out for is when he uh, he suddenly just bursts like... Oh, found him. What? Did I get him? Hey, that was an easy one, dude. Oof. Well, that was a flop. Yeah, you were, uh, you were significantly easier than everybody else. I, I... <laughs> no, big man. Mission complete. Well, not yet, but still. They uh, they all try to, to disappear, except they're all really bad at what they do. There's no way they're going to remain the bad guys, man. They're, they're just... Let's see. Well, it's not Gramps, but we should probably grab it anyway. So, let's see. Now we've got the motor for the motorcycle. I can't help but notice that you... Well, no, okay. Now, it's, it's a big motor, but... Yeah, you've got a uh, what appears to be a four valve. Well, I can't really tell that, can I? But you definitely have a two cylinder. So yeah, okay, this is definitely a motorcycle motor. Okay, I can, I can, I can dig the continuity here. The obscurest, curiouscurest. I'm sorry, curiouscurest. 
Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, we've got a motorcycle. All right. The captain says you crushed it, Agent 3. And they also had some choice things to say about Deep Cut. Wouldn't want to be them right now. Shh. Read me? Come in. Do you copy? Cramps, we read you. Not uh exactly loud and clear, but we read you. What's up? Are you okay? What's happening? Where are you? Finally got this dab-blasted thing to work again. Okay, so here's my report. I'm being held captive by someone or something calling themselves Mr. Grizz. I heard that loud and clear. As for where I am, beats me. But my left knee is aching something fierce, which means I'm at an altitude. Somewhere up high. Well, that's a pretty good hint. There's only one place that fits the bill, right? Well, well. Your injured knee may have betrayed this location, but don't expect any workers comp. Thank you for this, by the way. I won't underestimate the legendary leader of the Squid Beak Splatoon again. I'll just go ahead and deal with you now before you become an actual inconvenience. Wait a minute. Hey, what's that? What do you think you're doing? Ah! That didn't sound great for Gramps. Gramps, we're coming for you. Stay strong. Just as soon as we figure out how to get wherever you are, uh, do you think this? Th do you think some of this stuff we collected may come in handy? Agent Three, why don't you take a closer look at it? It may be our ticket to that rocket. All right, so I got to build a motorcycle. No problem. I think it's pretty clear that you have to get into that rocket somehow. Are you ready? Oh, hey, is all your hero gear the way you wanted? Uh. Hmm. Well, judging by the recording, yeah, you know what? Let's go. The captain's saying, this is the final confirmation. Are you sure you're <laughs> super ultra mega sure you're ready? You know what? I'm going to wait and give me a sec while I uh, look at the time on the recording and see. Maybe I'm, yeah, maybe I'll go for this. Let me see. All right. I'm pretty sure I'm ready to go. So if I end up breaking the recording up into multiple sections, then this would be the start of the next or final recording. If I keep going, then hey, I just kept going after big man. So I'm ready. Let's do it. I just confirmed. I checked to make sure that I pretty much 100% the area. The only thing I didn't do is like 100, 100% it yet. All right. So I'm totally ready to go. Let's do this. Final confirmation. Are you super ultra mega sure you're ready? I'm ready to go. All right, Gramps has to be up there somewhere. If it's like a giant area, uh, there's too much fuzz ooze in the way. I was going to say, if it's just like Octo Expansion, then there's going to be like another hour of gameplay left. Even Small Fry isn't that hungry. What about the Salmonids? I know this would be useful somehow if we could combine it. Yeah, throw the motor in the frame and let's go. You've always got the answer, Agent 2. It's totally worth a shot. Well, I mean, I got a chassis, I got a motor. By the power of chowder, combine. I was going to say, so we're building... I didn't know that... <laughs> I saw the motorcycle. I'm like, we don't, we don't have wheels or anything. We just have that. Look out, Fuzz. Here comes the captain. That looks dangerous as hell. We have, we have saw blades, circular blades. We've got... Okay, captain, go. All right, Agent 3. The OG Agent 3 now turned captain. Oh, my God. She's just going to town on this thing. She didn't, like, she, oh, God. I was going to say, she turned on the motor and just killed it. It's smoother than my skin now. No fair. You did it, Agent 3. Now then, smoothness, ride, let's save Gramps. I feel like we're... Oh, okay. I, I didn't actually end up going up there. Oh, you know, this is the area. Okay. I don't have a map or anything. Cap. Cap. Captain, are you okay? You simply can't go on. You sprained a tentacle. Well, we won't let you down. We'll go on without you. Come on, Agent 3. Let's wait one hot minute. That's right. It's us. You didn't think we were going to just give up, did you? Tell me you didn't. Giving up is for the weak. Do we look weak? Uh, well, Big Man certainly was. I never died to Big Man a single time. So, last chance. If you don't want to tangle with Deep Cut, put down the treasure and walk away. What they said. Oh, that thing? Yeah, we're done with it. It's all yours. You're done with it? Done with treasure? What's wrong with you? Plenty, but don't worry about that. <laughs> it's yeah, there's plenty wrong with us but look look if this pile of junk makes you feel better you can have it 
This is a trick, right? You expect us to believe you're going to give us the treasure after, well, everything? Wait, why am I fighting this? Wow, thanks. I was going to say, just, just take it. I feel kind of not good about each of us fighting you to the death. Our bad. And you're just giving us this? Seriously, such a boss move. Actually, why don't you be our boss? New boss, can I get a raise? Boss Mary! Looks like you have your own employees now. Have fun with that. Uh, we got a new Grizz. Oh, I'm going to have to approve their time cards, aren't I? Well, that was uh, that was pleasant in every way. Where, where are they? Where'd Deep Cut go? Now that Agent 2 is the boss of Deep Cut, we should definitely be able to rescue Gramps. I was going to say, Callie Mary, why don't you follow me out there? Like, you can fight too. You fought in Splatoon 2. Do you feel like we're being watched by Deep Cut specifically? What do you got? This alliance might just work out. Ow. Ouchie. Ouch. Yo. Why don't you take it easy, Cap? Alright, let's take a look at what we got around here. I can't believe they turned out to be so nice. And so familiar. Alright, so the question is, are there... Are there kettles? I can't stop thinking about poor Gramps all alone somewhere. We've got to focus and move on. You're our only hope, Agent 3. And, I mean, we're standing right here. Don't Yeah, don't forget about us. Uh, well, I was going to say there's... Uh, I'm sure now they want to help. Yeah, I guess it's just... It really is. There's nothing else. It's uh, straight up boss mode here. Let's go fight Mr. Grizz. Man, I've always wanted to fight Mr. Grizz. I hate this guy. Mr. Grizz. Ah, yeah, we're doing it. We're doing exactly like... Oh, what was that called? It was called Eterna Space Center Entrance. All right, so yeah, we're doing exactly what we did with Octo. I'm good with it. I'm absolutely good with it. Um, yeah, I'll keep this all in the same recording, I think. Whoa, they took everything. All of your, your hero gear. Oof, I mean, we didn't exactly surprise them, did we? We just charged in. If I were setting a trap for you, I'd be doing the Yay, the trap worked dance right now. I may do it anyway. It's a fun dance. I see your gear. You won't be able to get it back if you make it, or you'll be able to get it back if you make it through this. What do you think, Agent 3? You have your small fry. Are you going to give it a try? Would you be going in there fresh out of ink? Who am I kidding? Of course you would. Okay. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Small fry, you good? Perfect. All right, so just like Agent 8, we, uh, we're in the same position. At least they get a uh, welcoming committee. Careful, Agent 3. Ever heard of death by committee? You're looking at it. I was going to say, I'll just uh, I'll let Small Fry deal with you guys. Oh, uh, never mind. Right there. Easy. All right, so Small Fry... Take that one out. He's the hard one. <laughs> Eat his face off. There we go. Perfect. All right. I wish I could just punch him. Man, I could go to town too. Yeah. Where are you at now? Where are you at now, huh? Shoot me now. You can't. Well, look at that. Between Agent 3 and Small Fry, who needs fancy weapons? Ooh. Jump. Keep going. We can make it. Oh, I did not see that thing. I <laughs> I can't believe I just dove into it like that. That sucks. But I survived. My shield is intact and so is my spirit. All right, let's go. Two vaults. All right. Well, there's a checkpoint. And yeah, I'm going to pretty much need to do this. All right, let's go. Not exactly the fastest thing in the world, but all right. No problem. He's doing his best. He's just a little buddy. All right. Um, nothing nothing tricky here. It looks pretty straightforward. What is that smell? What do you mean? I don't smell anything. Oh, I can't go in there. Let me just double check to make sure I didn't do that wrong. Nope. I think that's Fry's way of sniffing out a key. All right. Onwards we go. Alright, just double checking. I don't want to miss anything interesting. Alright, this should take me... Oh, hi. 
What's up? Boom, get your... Oh, what? <laughs> that was weird. He, uh, he actually... That thing shot and took out Small Fry for a sec. All right, let's go. And grab the key. Now, what was the other one, though? That's one key in your pocket. Where's the other one? All right, let's go. So, I mean, I can just tank this thing, so... Ow. Small fry? Small fry? Might want to work faster, small fry. Oof, that was super close. All good. That's what I get for saying, oh, I can just tank this thing. You know what? That's that's exactly what I earned. Oh, you know what? That one would have broken easier, so I didn't... I, you know what? I took the hard mode. I took the hard route anyway, so... I'm making things hard on myself. It's my fault. All right, let's go. The key is mine. Grab a couple of power eggs while I'm at it. Vault one, vault two. Nice. Interesting. Hmm. What do you think that could be? All right, why don't you sit right there, little buddy? I'm curious what's on the second level here. Is there anything important? So then, what was the first level? You know what? I'm gonna let that. I'm gonna let that go, and I'm gonna see what's on that first level. Yeah, get back here. Nothing. Oof, balloons. Oh, okay. Or ooh, balloons. I'm sorry. All right, let's. Uh, oh crap. There we go. Just a quick reward, nothing big. All right, no problem. I was thinking I didn't want to get duped into like taking the uh, the wrong path when there was a better option. All right, go right there. Onwards we go. All right, there's my makeshift Rolonium. Rolonium, I also miss being in Splatfest. Wait a second. Oh, hi. Another trap. Yeah, well, he's he, it was a trap for him. He's getting his face eaten off. Yeah, how's that feel? How's that feel, big guy? Yeah, that's what I... Oh, I, okay. I was going to say, if it's stuck up there, then that's very unfortunate. But it did. It fell. Didn't really obey the, the acceleration of gravity, but that's all right. All right, give me my stuff. Nice. You got your gear back. Agent 3, be careful. Or careful, Agent 3. We've already seen a few traps. There could be more. Giant deadly monster? Hmm. Oh, I was going to say that. It looks like it, it looked like I could go through that. All right, next up. You and Small Fry did great, but it must be a relief to have your gear back. Don't you think we should get a move on? Look for another way, Agent 3. There's got to be one around here somewhere. You don't always go, all right, Grizz or whatever your name is. What's the deal with these ropes? Ropes? Those are corporate engagement facilitators, and they're going to help me save the world. Or they are helping me save the world. I simply require a representative of Earth like you. Don't you see? Help you? Somebody help me. Mr. Grizz, what do you... Anyway, if you really do want to help, I'm sure you can't... I'm sure you can't do this much. Untie me. Never fear. You will be free soon. And together, we shall bristle forth into a fuzzy and profitable new era. Oh, I get it. You've gone fishing completely out to sea. You're just trawling us. You've gone fishing. <laughs> that's a nice way of saying that. Uh... Oh, I thought there was something there. I was going to say, that's, that's an incredible way to say... Wait, is this... Is this a level or... Yeah, this is a level. I was going to say, this isn't me climbing back down the, the tower. It is me climbing back down the tower. All right. Well, I don't want to go back down. I want to go up. Okay. Area two. Here we go. Alterna Space Center hangar. Warning. This is a restricted area. Entry is prohibited. All routes closed while launch sequence initiates. Have a nice day. They really don't want you to... Oh, this is going to be satisfying. Don't hesitate now or we'll lose everything. Oh, 
Caleb. You are all that remains. I'll let you get your... E yeah, I was going to say, I'll bite your face off there. So much for the area being restricted. Take out the Octarians. All right, the Octarian menace. I'm guessing, man. Hey, that's a wave breaker. Well, yeah, since you're giving me all these, I'll just let... Yeah, you guys are going to die. In fact, you specifically get your face eaten off. You too. Hmm. I'm still saying this is my prediction is that... Oh, check it out. This is why I'm spamming the uh, specials because I keep getting more. Nice. Oh, yeah, that felt satisfying. <gasps> my reef slider. I'm a riding my shark. Die. Nice. Dude, I am predicting that uh, Grizz is here and we're going to stop Grizz rising to the top just like a superstar. I'm going to say Grizz is going to be there. Of course, Grizz is going to be trying to be the bad guy. And then all that's going to happen is um, DJ Octavio is going to come in and try to shake things up. He's going to be like, I was the true bad guy the entire time. I've always been the, the real villain. So it's going to be like Grizz. It's going to be similar to how Deep Cut is. Is that Deep Cut was uh, the bad guy, quote unquote. And then, uh, and then in reality, they're just kind of fools, you know. And Grizz is going to be like the bad guy. But then the bad, bad guy is actually going to be DJ Octavio. Uh, you know what? Yeah, I'm just going to... I'm going to save my splashdown. Eat his face off. I can't reach, can I? Yeah. All right, here we go. Nice. All right, now I can save my splashdown and I can use it for whatever I want. Oh, yeah. You guys, this is going to be fun. Check it out. Oh, that didn't... Okay. I thought that I thought a splashdown was gonna be OP there. Have fun with that. Later. I misjudged exactly what special would work there. Actually, since they're just giving me specials like crazy that all fit perfectly into what I'm facing, the challenges I'm actually fighting at the moment, then I am. Uh, oh, crab tank! I was gonna say I'm just gonna continue to use exactly what they're giving me. All right, there we go. Now for you. Eat your face off. Oh, crap. Man, I just want to get... I want to I wanna hit you with my, uh, my little guy. Here we go. All right, little buddy. Oh, that sucks. Okay, I guess we got to do it the way that they want us to. I got to take him out. Come on, little buddy, go. Eat his face off. There we go. I was waiting for that, man. I wanted to I wanted to bite his face off with little buddy. That's how I wanted to do it. I didn't want to just take it out the normal way. All right, so we got another crab tank. Let's go. Keep it up. You've made it so far. All right, final checkpoint. Here we go. Grab some power eggs and, uh, hmm. I was going to say, I kind of want to explode you, but at the same time, I can't. I, I unfortunately, for the moment, need you. Yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna predict that. For sure, it's going to be Grizz is the bad guy. And it's going to be like, oh, no, Grizz. And then what's really going to happen is it's going to be Octavio comes in and, and is going to be like, I've implemented my master plan this entire time. You're all fools. Did I not need my crab tank? That's unfortunate. Yeah, it looks like this is going to be... Okay, I know we've had a few false Gramps signals, but I'm pretty sure that he's on the launch pad. Oh, and how in the world are we supposed to get over there? I don't know for sure, but if we can get into this building on the right, we'll find an answer. The world as it exists now is out of balance. One cannot run a world or a business. Mammals and marine creatures have traded places, and not for the better. As CEO, I must be the one to restore balance to nature. Are you... For now, I will let the fuzzy one spread. Fuzzy ooze spread and watch the golden eggs pile up. My employees have been extremely diligent. Hey, buddy, you talk to me because I got no idea what you're saying. You let the bad guy monologue. That's how I know Grizz ain't the bad, bad guy. 
Because the true bad, bad guy doesn't monologue until after it's all done. Then it's going to be, ha, 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 ha. It was me all along. That's what's going to happen, man. I'm telling you. Octavio, I'm ready for you. Mystic Grizz, though. So Mr. Grizz is uh, trying to trying to be the avatar. Restoring balance to this earth. All right, let's go. Yeah, this does. I'll, I'm probably going to keep this together. I'll turn a space center left. I'm going to keep the recording together. Can can we turn on a light or something? We'll have to rely on other senses like sharks do. All right. Well, I guess here we go. I can see well enough. This is ominous. I mean, look, I've got ink armor. What else could you ask for? Hey, we're moving. Yeah, well, just in case I get attacked while I'm moving, I'm going to have everything inked up so I can move around. It is. Uh, it has treated me well in the past. That strategy of always having everything inked. I mean, heck, look at me. I took out uh, Inner Agent 3 in the first... Oh, crap. Is he dead? Yeah, he's good. I have other bombs, but I feel like uh, Little Buddy is better than any other bomb. I took out Inner Agent 3 on the first try, and that's, that's how I did it, man. That's exactly how I did it. Can't reach. There we go. There we go. I wish this thing moved faster. Well, not really. I mean... Okay, there we go. Alright, need my shield back. That'd be nice. There we go. Alright, here we go. Can I reach it with a burst bomb? Yes, I can. Let's hide behind here. <laughs> Let's just get into position. And down you go. Goodbye. All right. Checkpoint achieved. If only we were so lucky. All right. So we're on the move again. I was going to say, where are these guys at? Nice. Easy does it. No problem. All right, so they're coming from above, but I'm also prepared. Oh, you know what? Hey, let me grab that. All right, we're good. Crates. I like crates. All right, perfect. That takes you out. That takes you out. No, that doesn't take you out. Now you're taken out. All right, let's go. It just keeps going. Oh, it's getting bigger. Nice. All right, so it's getting bigger, which is good and bad. Is the elevator getting bigger? Yes, it is, in fact. And not only that, Octarians. Oh, heck yeah, dude. We're doing this. I mean, you guys are uh, You're going to have to spawn a little faster than that if you're going to take me out. Or at least roll or something, but hey. All right. Hey, look, we got Octarians. All right. I was going to say, there was multiples that time. All right, we are definitely doing this deathmatch style. All right, we got a sniper. Yeah, I can't reach. But you were distracted by a little buddy, so that was kind of funny. All right, we finally stopped. Okay. Nice. We'll have to take the lift up, but... Well, we climbed, we unclimbed, and now we're here. I hope Gramps is really at the launch pad. I'm still not sure how to get there. Hey, I see a pipe that's connected to the rocket. Good eye, Fry. The pipe is definitely big enough for Agent 3 to fit through. Am I wrong? Very brave to volunteer Agent 3 like that. All right, let's go. This has been bugging me, but why were you after the treasure anyway? Just because it's treasure? We were doing it for Splatsville. Not everyone there is, are as, is as fresh as we are. That's right. We plan to sell the treasure and divide the profits among the needy. We'll keep a shallow cut. Whoa, you're actually heroes? And here we thought... Well, I don't want to say what we thought. Thanks, boss. Oh, for a second I thought I could clear that. All right. It seemed like we're still in the uh, the overworld map, you know, where I, I'm clearing stuff. And Man, look at that. You can see all of it. I was going to say I'd be really impressed if I can still see my ink. No, because I reset the game. So I'm kind of curious now. If I inked that up and then I were to come back here, can I still see it in the distance? Or is it just loaded as a... Uh, rendered as a normal image, you know? All right, here we go. Rails through the pipe. Not exactly a fan of that. 
And this is the next area. The Spirit Lifter Steerage. We're in. Looks like we've got more climbing to do. We'll be rooting for you. Safely from the ground, but far, far below. Yeah, thanks, big man. Really appreciate that. You know, you guys, maybe big man, not so much, but at least Fry and uh, Shiver could have helped out. All right. Let's climb. Mr. Grizz boss fight. I wonder what that could entail. What would a Mr. Grizz boss fight be like? Hey, check this out. Uh, die. Okay, you, you, uh, yeah, you, you weren't supposed to have your shield. Uh, that was kind of awkward. I kind of just, I don't want to look you in the eyes when I'm done with you. I just want you to die and go away. I don't want to actually have to, like, look you in the eye and be like, BAM! It gets awkward. All right. Nice, uh, nicely done, little buddy. Let's do this. Rolonium, miss you. Want you back in Splatfest so bad. That's, you know what they should do is if they're going to do, uh, or, well, I mean, if they're going to do, we're probably close to the final Splatfest, to be honest. Uh, they should do tricolor battles with gimmicks. That way it feels like Shifty Station, you know? All right, take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Nice. All right, and now for you. Oh, what's wrong? What's wrong? You got a problem? Can't see me? Boom. Easy. Next to the rail. Such heavy security here. Actually, it was pretty tame, all things considered. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, I forgot. I can't do that. Okay, or we're all good. Everything's fine. I forgot this isn't one of the rails that I can actually do that with. You know what I could actually do? I'm curious if I should even bother trying, but I, uh, I can actually... No, nope, we're just going to do this. There we go. I was going to say I could jump up, shoot them, and get back on the rail before... Before I uh, morph or before I phase through it. All right, so here we go. Don't get fuzzy. Oh, that was super close. Okay, don't touch the fuzzy. If it gets fuzzy, I, then it turns into little fuzzy guys. I mean, it's gonna be like my cat. It's gonna be fuzzy. All right, so this one's easier. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. No. Ah, oh, I'm fuzzy. Actually, I think I'm morphed. I'm dead. Continue. Didn't mean for that to happen. That was not my intention. All right, let's try that one more time. I thought it was going to be a little simpler than that, and I thought, okay, no problem. Yeah, I can do this. Can you not make that jump? Because I am not sure you can. Yeah, I can make the jump. That was intense. No, yeah, I botched it once. Oh, okay. Didn't realize that was going to be how it happened. Just going to let the Octarians do their thing, roll past me. Later. You probably have to die. Yeah, you, you do. You need to die. As do you. As do you. Alright, what's above here? Nice. Okay, uh... Yeah, give me the stamper. Let, let's go stamper. You know what? Actually, yeah, I'm gonna climb up this with the stamper, because I feel like that's just super satisfying, and I feel great doing it. So, boom. Take that. Up we go. Looks like you can take a quick breather. Actually, everything's pretty tame around here. The great zapfish in the, is in that huge container. So this is where it's been the whole time. We need to bring it back. All right, so that's how I know that it's going to be DJ Octavio. The Spirit Lifter. Nice. Launch preparations nearing completion. Please exercise care near the closing bulkheads. Rude, it shut us out. Guess that's a no. that way's a no-go. Hmm... Hold on, look at those floating energy cores. I'm helping. <laughs> okay, hear me out. We got some energy cores, we flip the switch, and then something, right? Won't know unless we try. Let's steal them. All right, let's do it. Grab my armor and off we go. All right, here we go. Easy. I was going to say, I had a feeling that that was coming. All right, here we go. Zipcaster. One. Two. There's a couple. I missed. Oh, but it's an infinite one. That helps. Nice. All right. 
Emergency systems activated, releasing bulkhead number one. Now we're getting somewhere. There's still another bulkhead and more energy cores. Get him. All right, let's go. Can't go that far. But I can go up there. Uh, that. Oh, God. I was going to say that does me no good. I just messed that up. All right, let's go. Can I get there? No, I can't. How about now? Yeah, I can get there. Nice. Okay. There we go. Checkpoint achieved. All right. We got to be careful. I don't want to get fuzzy. Don't want to get fuzzy in this. There we go. Area. Fuzzy is bad here. Fuzzy is normally good. Fuzzy bad here. All right. All right, let's grab this one and these ones. Oh, you know what? Actually, yeah, I got to go back and get that one now. All right. Zip casting. I'm not really great with zip casting, apparently, but that's all right. Hanging in there. All right, here we go. So, yeah, I got to go back and do that. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. I was going to say, I saw him there. I'm like, I need to take this thing out. All right, here we go. Oh, 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 that's not what I meant to do. Oh, that sucks. Oh, look at me all the way back here. All right, well, at least I see, you know, it's a little more organized this time. The first time I did this, it was, uh, it was me missing a bunch of them. But this time I can just go in a straight line and grab all of them now. The way it was intended to be, not the way that I did it. Nice. All right. So I know, yeah, that one's that one's the one that messed me up. And speaking of things that are messing me up, I've got a cat. Hi, buddy. He jumped up here. Oh, no, that's not good. Okay, I didn't die. <laughs> Sorry, my cat being up here is, uh, has already thrown my game off. All right, I need to make sure that he's comfortable while we're playing Splatoon. All right. Yeah, you're, you're good. You're comfortable. Because what what more could I want than my cat's comfort while I'm playing a game? All right. So let me let me see. Yeah, I was going to say I got up here like that. And then there we go. Now I see the exact spots that I went. I can just retrace my steps. My steps pre kitty. Hi, hey, buddy. Man, why are you gripping so hard? Yeah, you're just you're just a happy cat. He's he's a super happy kitty. I'm good with that, guys. Trust me. I may I may sound like I'm having difficulties. I'm getting a signal. There are five remaining. I may sound like I'm having difficulties with the kitty. Uh, ooh. All right. So this one's yeah, this one's gonna be a little tricky. Not a problem. It doesn't go down through the ooze. That's the important part. All right. Uh, yeah. You know what? We're gonna do this. As soon as that platform comes down, I right, pet my cat. He's happy. He wants everybody on the recording to know he's happy. I missed. It was three feet in front of me. I missed. Wait for it to come down. There we go. All right. So I think that means there's two left. There's this one. And the last one, wherever that may be. All right, let's go down just a little bit. Here we go. Yep, did not contact the fuzzy. And check it out, found the last one. There we go, no fuzziness. Emergency systems activated, releasing bulkhead number two. That was fire. All right, here we go. I think that's the way out. I bet it opens to the same way as the bulkhead, or it opens the same way as the bulkheads. Keep cool. You're almost there. All right. Let's take a look around. Got myself a nice checkpoint. Going to go there and climb it up. All right. You know what we're going to do? Hang on. Uh, sort of. That's almost where I was at. Now I just need to back out and do that. There we go. I knew I could do it. I believed in myself that that was how I was going to... Oh, jeez. Dude. All right. I need, to, I need to move the controller a little bit. 
All right, hang on. I know it looks like I, I, I'm, I don't know exactly what I'm doing here, but uh, it's all part of my plan. Oh my God. I am so close. I could do this. All right, hang on. Let me see how high I can do this. How did I do it the first time? That's how I did it the first time. I need to I need to straighten the controller out and do this. There we go. Alright. Don't know how I felt the first time, but I'm good. Activating system activation failed. Insufficient energy. Hi. Who's this? Oh, hello. Okay. Now I see these platforms and I see the... Oh, crap. All good. Sort of all good. Can I hit that one from here? It'd be really cool if I could, but I can't. All right, hang on. Can I hit that one? No. Yes, I, I can actually hit that one. Oh, no, I touched the ink. Oh, oh that sucks. All right, one more try with that. It's all good. All right, we got some armor. All right, we're going to have to, we have to move quick. Here we go. As long as he doesn't get a line of sight on me. I was going to say, I, I, <laughs> I wanted to drop down and destroy him. All right, that's definitely all of them. Head to the exit. All right, we're good. It was questionable at first, but uh, just one little mishap. Emergency systems activated. Releasing door lock. All right, here we go to the rocket ship. Oh, my God. There are three components to my business plan. I want to hear this. The vessel, the spirit, and the wisdom of ages. Someone is taking notes, yes? What are you blabbering about, blathering on about? Hey, don't come any closer. Look at all the eggs. Your brain, ensconced through it, may be your hideous... Leave my brain out of this. Hey, what's that for? Get away from it. I keep uh, I keep not reading it. Not fast enough, anyways. I was looking at the power eggs, and I didn't read that. Uh, it seems like things are kind of going badly for Gramps right now. Yeah, I hope his brain can hold out till we get there. Please hurry, Agent 3. I'm sure his brain is fine. I mean, he's elderly. That's normal stuff going on. In fact, I'm going to get up there, and Grizz is going to be like, I haven't touched him. Literally nothing has happened up here. I don't know what he's complaining about. To be a visionary in business and in life, one must be prepared to make tough decisions. I must leverage the suffering of my employees into a brighter, fuzzier future for all. Mr. Grizz, I always knew you were a bad guy. I always knew you couldn't pay back your debts. I always knew you didn't have the small guy in mind. You always exploited your 1099 employees. All right, Grizzy, let's do this thing. I'm going to feel so satisfied after two games I finally get to shoot you. Gramps, we're here to save you. What? Oh, my God. That's so dark. Dehydrated in his prime. Oh, my God. What happened to him? Oh, my God, dude. It's a giant bear. What the heck? Welcome. The Ursine Anomaly 03, Mr. Grizz. Hey, your overgrown furball turned Gramps back into Gramps. Valued employees, we appreciate your feedback. However, it will not be implemented at this time. What's that supposed to mean? Dude, what the heck is this ending? So we actually saw the mummified, uh, the mummified inkling, and it, th like I just found that, and now I see Gramps looking like that. Holy crap! All right, we're launching a fuzzy dude. It means the end of your employment, Mister Grizz. Not everybody works for you, and the end of the world as you know it. To be clear. As per my memo, I will be coating the planet in fuzzy ooze in an effort to restore balance. Don't call it 
Harrimageddon, HR doesn't like it. He is so hilarious. He's still like talking like the corporate Grizzy is. No, the rocket. Gramps! Oof, man. He's all dried up. But how? Agent 3 let a tear out. Agent 3 showed emotion. Well, to be fair, Agent 3 was like with him longer than anybody. I mean, obviously the granddaughters, but phew, somebody got a drop, the drop onto me. Anybody else? Oh, also a bit lighter and way flatter. Talking squid jerky? Thank goodness you're uh, all right-ish. Hey, wait. We're still in danger. The rocket. The fuzz. Dude, look what they did to him. Cuttlefish. But we'll never be able to catch that rocket. It's impossible. What can we do? I was going to say, Deep Cut, help us out. Sounds like you folks need some help. And Deep Cut is here to steal the spotlight. Swirl it up, eels. I was going to say, you guys have a lot of resources between your eels, your shark, and, well, big man being big man. Ah, uh, we're going to we're gonna do this, huh? Can I ride your shark? Your turn, Master Mega. I want to ride the shark up the tornado. Here. Oh my god, please let me control that shark. It's the greatest reef slider of all time. Stay fresh up there, kid. The fate of the world is in your hands. Now, you two is a little small fry. Dude, oh my god, that was sweet. I wish I could control that shark. I'm telling you, Splatoon needs a racing game. All right, so I have Agent 3's original gear. Wait, where's Mr. Grizz? I am in space. I am ingling in space. So we finally got to this point. Grizz, what in the hell happened to you? Well, well, such dedication to your work. I think you've earned yourself a break. A break from life? Now come here so I can break you. This is over the top and ridiculous in every way. Let's do it. All right, so I still have a cat on my lap. Oh, we're, we're, uh, we're going to do this in Salmon Run style, huh? All right, let's do this. Two eggs required. Oh, ow. Okay, hold on. The only thing I've got a question is what... So did he... Is he in control of the Octos, those Octos, because he got the fuzzy ink? All right, dodge that. Ah, throw it on him. Oh, okay, yeah, actually, he does have a weak point. Oh, crap. Okay, a fuzzball came out. All right, where, where, where's the fuzzball? I don't see it. Oh, okay, I see. I got to eat him. Or I've got to send a uh, little buddy after him. No problem, I can do that. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Take that, big guy. We're not clocking out that easily. I can't believe this is Grizz's true form, dude. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. <laughs> How did he even get control of the fuzzy ink? Did he cause the fuzzy ink? More fuzzy ooze. Actually, it's fuzzy ooze. It's not even ink. All right. Oh, my God. He is so over the top. <laughs> I almost can't even take him seriously. All right. Checkpoint. Gotcha. Go ahead and give me the power egg. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm just going to... There we go. I'm just going to take these guys out, tank their shields, and take them out. All right. Three? Yeah, three. All right, no problem. Uh-oh. I was going to say, hold on. Oh, crap. It was rotating, and I didn't even notice it. I was trying to notice it, or I was trying to get going, but I couldn't get the uh, little buddy off of me. All right, so let's take this one out first. Actually, you guys are irrelevant. I don't even need you. Let's do that, and then I'll... looks like I'll be rotating up this thing, so... All right, here we go. 
All right, let's go. Keep it up. You're halfway through the rotation. Oh, geez. I am barely keeping up, dude. Oh, my God. Am I good? All good. Everything's good? Yeah, we're good. Tank the shields. Take you guys out. All right, so now I see what's going on. Uh, let me address this cat. All right, we're all good. Cat was squirming a little bit. I was like, oh, my God. He was uh, he was getting a little antsy there. I'm like, all right, well, let's uh, let's go play with the cat. Let's go take care of the cat. All right, uh, which way are we rotating this time? I can't tell. But, yeah, I don't think... Oh, we're not rotating, that's why. All right, hang on, he's going to do that crazy thing. Wait, you have triple ink strikes? You can't have triple ink strikes. I use triple ink strikes. Oh, crap. All right, let's go. Oh, I wasn't close enough? All right. Oh, yeah. Get out of the way. All right, so... Oh, no, no. I got I got the order of events backwards. I got to shoot him. Oh, I ran into it. I didn't mean, didn't mean to do that. All right, here we go. Now we're good. Nice. All right. A setback, but this is a growth industry. You got one more, Grizzy. You got one more in you, Grizzy. That's all you get. Nice. Dude, this is such an over-the-top crazy battle. Where'd he go? He's fallen apart, man. He ain't got much left. So there is a block of wood that is a sentient bear inside of this giant fuzzy monster, right? That's that's the point we're at. All right, let's do it. One, two. I'm still kind of waiting for us to rotate, but I guess... Oh, hi. All right. Not a problem. Not a problem at all. Messing around with... Uh, oh, crap. Dropping specials on me like I don't know how to deal with those. All right, here we go. He's going to roll again. He's doing an alligator death roll, only it's a bear roll. Give me that egg and let's go. All right, here we go. All right, so if I keep moving forward, I can get the drop on them, I think. Yeah, let's do this. Let's get the drop on them. I'm not as scared of the rolling now. I'm going to use it to my advantage. You know what? Actually, I don't need you. I can just do this. All right, let's... Perfect. Perfect shot. There we go. All right, let's do it. He's up to something. What? Oh, he's... You can't do that. That's... You stole Pearl's move. You stole the princess cannon. You can't do that. That's a uh, breach of contract. That's a, uh, that's a copyright right there. You should know better than that, Grizz. What, you, you're, you're not in charge of the legal department? Yeah, he, he ain't in... Oh, okay, nice move. You skunked me a little bit there. All right, Grizzy, time to blow up. Dude, this is ridiculous. <laughs> we are proactive, aren't you? But it's time to clock out. In a few moments, Earth will be ruled by mammals once again. I mean, a lot of good the mammals did for it. Grizz, were you aware of that phone? Are you aware of Tartar? Do you know how that went for him? Oh, no. Oh, no. It's exactly who I said it was going to be. Octavio, I told you. Not if I crash your big finish. You're not dropping this beat on our turf. We'll hype you up from here, Agent 3. Yeah, how can you even see what's going on? Listen up, it's going down. Repping the Splatlands, we are deep cut. Ready up there? Let's burst that bear. You lip sync, we drip ink. All right. Shiver, Fry, and Big Man. Uh, our turn. Hit it. That heavenly melody. I was going to say, wait a minute. He's playing the Calamari incantation. He can't do that. 
Also, I did not realize that that was what was playing because I didn't play Splatoon 1. I did not realize during the Inner Agent 3 battle that that was the song that was playing. Little buddy. Look, marine life energy is flowing up there. Streams of light. Three lights united to consume the disaster. Oh my god, he turned into a barracuda. Or like a sturgeon. Or he's an alligator gar. Small Fry and Mr. Grizz got hugeified. They're so adorable. He's a giant alligator gar. The bear is filled with fuzzy ooze. Eliminate the fuzzballs to help Huge Fry. Er, just quoting the captain down here. He's trying to deliver the fuzzy ooze himself. You've got to stop him. Return of the Mammalians. Well, I mean, look at our planet. It's you ooze, you lose. Go back to Ursa, whiner. You ready, Octavio? Do I get to do it? Pilot hatch unlocked. Fuzzballs meet my ink vac. Hop in, Agent 3. Oh, you heard him. Steer the Octobot King and vacuum those fuzzballs up. Dude. We only have three minutes and 33 seconds before he slams into Earth. Three, three, three. Ah, I get it. I love it. Oh, dude, what the heck? <laughs> this is amazing. All right. Suck the fuzzballs. Here we go. Okay. Uh, yeah, I see. I, I, I get how this is going. All right, here we go. Nice. Dude, I am playing as DJ Octavio. That's hilarious. It's not as epic, if you will, as uh, the last time we did something like this, but I, I dig it. Also, yeah, I was going to say, I don't have little buddy anymore, so I guess what I'm going to do is... Uh-oh. Can I... Oh, I was going to say, can I tank those, or do they hurt me? All right, so... We just got to navigate those. We're, we can't afford to to fight those all right so we got little buddy or i guess huge buddy fighting over there while i'm just sitting here trying to de-escalate <laughs> the giant freaking bear so this is how the world ends with applause and a giant bear and a barracuda all right so i was right about dj octavio sort of but i still say that octavio is going to try to swoop in and take all this for himself the enemy of my enemy until until he can get back to his normal i was gonna say i can just tank that but oh my god all right i'm trying to dodge the, oh 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 they're on me okay i didn't see that i didn't see that they were actually on me we didn't make it oh do i get to see the end of the world just like it yeah they always throw this in there for when you fail That's, uh, oops. On that day, a massive fuzzball was born in space. Let's try that one more time. I didn't realize what was going on with that. I, uh, I got attacked while I was on the ship and I didn't realize they were actually not in space. All right, so yeah, I gotta I gotta dismount on that. Get out of here. Fight them off the top and then pull it back. I don't know why I thought that they were not there. I wasn't looking at my actual ride because on the second one there was nobody there. On this one, I just have to dodge. All right, so I last time I did this, I tanked the fuzzball, but this time I... Okay, I guess I'm going to tank the fuzzball again. I didn't mean to do that, but that's what the armor is there for. I mean, at the end of the day, I got to use the armor, right? That's why it's there. How ironic for you to be taken out by a salmonid. All right, so now we go to the backside, and I just got to remember... Two left to go. All right, here we go. All right, so this one. Oh, crap. Yeah, I, I tanked it again. I didn't mean to do that. You just need to slip in here, get here, and then wait for those. Uh... All 
All right, here we go. Let's get in close. And now I got to wait for those stampers. Yeah, the stampers are going to... There they are. Okay. Nice. All right. Not fooling me this time. My bad on the last one. Oh, I was going to say, just take him out. We're so close, man. We're so close. All right. One more to go. Here we go. Got uh, 90 seconds left to do it. Now or never. All right. So this time... All right. I got you. Just got to dodge the fuzzball. Okay. Tank the fuzzball. Not a problem. Octavio, you had way more HP than this when, uh, when we fought. All right, let's do this. Shields back up. Yep, shields back up. One minute left. Okay, here we go. All good. All good. Tank the shield. Or I shouldn't say tank it. I didn't tank it. I just, I, I drove it in. Come on. Come on. That's it. He's still on the move. I'll tell you what. We'll fire the fuzz right back. This is so satisfying, but I only have 22 seconds. We got to kill it. <laughs> Dude, I bet 19 seconds. You got to do some damage. I think I made it. How is that? It seems all of my work has been for nothing. How is that the final boss? The times have changed. The world can never be as it was. Moving forward is the future. I suppose this is it then. You will not receive severance pay. So, that was my salmon run guy. Who? Uh, so, how do I do salmon run now? If only that thing was in the game. Oh, he reverted back to the little buddy. I was going to say, that would be a sweet King Salmonid to have a giant Barracuda slash Sturgeon slash whatever he was supposed to be. So we killed Mr. Grizz. So who's in charge of Salmon Run now, out of curiosity? And that's it. <laughs> Just like Splatoon 2, we're back into where we go into the Splatcast and everything's back to normal. I wonder if I had still left up the message. Well, I couldn't. I was going to say, uh, well, yeah, I could. I could have disconnected from the internet and then I would have skipped the Splatcast and I would have never seen the Splatfest stuff. So we could have gone into the Splat, the, the splat stuff for uh, for the... I can barely contain myself. I was going to say, we could have gone with the results for the Splatfest and then gone right into this. What is it, big man? Breaking news. Same thing as we did in Splatoon 2. Is this the return of the great Zapfish? Oh, yeah. I kind of forgot about that thing. Is that how it always looked? Who cares? It's safe. No, there's more. Broken news. That's breaking news, so hurry and break it already. Let me guess. This is about the new Squid Sisters single, right? Because if so, yeah, I heard about it, and yeah, I'm big mad about it. Wait, it says Squid Sisters on the label, but look at those two. Is it really them? Oh, I think it's, uh, that was a reference to the, yeah, that's totally a reference to Splatoon Island, the April Fool's joke they had, where they had them like that. Forgive us, boss ladies. Oh yeah, I forgot, they're their bosses now. Deep Cut will open for the Squid Sisters anytime. When are we going on tour? Great idea, Shiver. Deep Cut and Squid Sisters World Tour. Well, all I know is that uh, next up is the DLC. I uh, I held off on the DLC for a long time for Splatoon 2, and now I'm doing all three of them, so you know I'm going right into this. From here to side order. The only thing I got to say is that was a... Yeah, I was going to say, here's... So we're doing the, we're doing the credits, and we're going to go right through this, but I mean... 
we're uh, we're kind of in the middle of space at this point. So it's like, I don't know. They they took it they took it even further. It was like the first the Octo expansion was like over the top, but in a good way. Fighting Grizz in space. Uh, what were the alternative storylines that got trashed? I wonder. Because that was a little run. I mean, we, we don't even have an explanation how he was able to do that. Also, I think Cuttlefish, he's not dead. He's just, he's not very alive anymore. Because we never resolved that. They, he killed him and we sort of brought him back to life. But he's just kind of a, a little fish flake now. So, and we never resolved that. We never actually fixed him. So, RIP sort of to Cuttlefish. Uh, is that how we're leaving the Earth? We're just going to leave it like that? I feel like that's probably not a good idea. Also, that's what Cuttlefish looks like. They're confirming it. He's right there. He's just going to be, like, barely alive now. I like that they're okay with that. He accepted that very quickly, but I think he wants his original body back. But I don't... I mean, we never resolved that storyline. I mean, we have ink in space now. We're not even worried about the fact that Cuttlefish died and then sort of came back. We never even resolved that storyline. Oh, I never realized Bandai Namco was involved in Splatoon. Huh. I wonder what they did. I'm actually going to look that up. I didn't even realize they were involved in this game. Alright, so I, did it look like there was a, a thing, like an actual creature? Or, you know, it was probably Grizz's dead body floating in the atmosphere, but that can't be good for the Earth to have the sun blocked out by a bunch of ink in the middle of space. I'm also very surprised that that is how, like, we didn't, so we didn't get any explanation on the Salmonids, what their role was, other than just, they kill stuff. And we got one rogue Salmonid who turned into a Barracuda and saved the planet. Hmm. Interesting decision for the ending. But, thank you for playing. Hero Mindset Replica. Hero Suit Replica. Hero boot replica, hero shot. And hey, at least this time I got all the... Yeah, they're just confirming it. Cuttlefish gets to live as basically being barely alive. A secret kettle has appeared. See where it takes you. Let me guess, secret boss fight. And that's it. That's the end. I got nothing more for you. I'm assuming that there's going to be a, uh, a secret boss fight, but I will get to that at some point. That said, that's the end of Splatoon 3. There have been a lot of you that have watched from Octo Expansion into Splatoon 3, so I appreciate that you guys have been leaving comments and letting me know that you guys enjoyed it. So with that said, Side Order is coming up next immediately. No lag at all, just going right into Side Order. Hopefully, I will have that done before we even talk about anything crazy like a final Splatfest. This time, unlike Octo Expansion, it was nice for Octo Expansion to be kind of a walk down memory alley for me because the final Splatfest was about, it was like the aftermath of Octo Expansion, except I hadn't played the Octo Expansion. So for me, it had a whole new meaning when I played the Octo Expansion, looking back at the final Splatfest. So this time, I won't let that happen. I will take care of side order, I will play side order, and then we will finish this game up, man. Like, the life of this game anyways. Humble and proud, I am Nito Marquis, and that's another series closed. Thank you very much for watching, my friends. And I guess if there's a secret boss fight afterwards, I'll record that too. Catch you later.